Wait, 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 wait. Hey, welcome back to our hungry adventures. Guys, in a few weeks I'm gonna leave Thailand. However, while I'm still in Bangkok, I'd love to recommend you a few places from my personal list which you should visit on your next trip to Thailand. Today we are visiting SVU Money Market and I love it for three main reasons. It's amazing location here in the city center, it's cleanliness and variety of foods and food prices. Four reasons actually. Anyway, it is a really amazing market and today, if you have got some time and empty space in your stomach and you are ready to waste your precious time together with me, you can join me in this hungry adventure. Let's go! So what is SVU? SVU means Srinakarin Birot University and as you see Everything around me, these are university buildings, different faculties. And probably there is one more reason why I love visiting this market, since it is a university. <laughs> there are so many pretty girls around, I'm sorry, I can't hold it inside of me. Probably this, may, this might be even the main reason why I love coming here. Last time I made a video about this place during times of the pandemic, about two or two and a half years ago, and it was pretty pretty much empty however now I can see that it has become much bigger today I can finally say that this market is back to life and the entire Bangkok is back to life there are many tourists there are many foods businesses are back to normal people are still wearing masks though but uh, the air condition the air pollution of Bangkok require you to wear this mask just to protect your lungs from these tiny particles in the air however people people are smiling they are smiling with their eyes anyway guys i'm losing myself let's grab let, let's grab something to eat you are Mickey Scott. Mickey Scott. yes and you uh, I I, I subscribe you on YouTube. Ah, uh, yeah. nice, nice. Me, Do you me, study here? Yes. I see uh, you've got uh, SPU, SPU t-shirt. SPU, yeah. Tamay? Yeah, SPU. What do you study? Uh, I study in educational. Educational. Yeah, so this is, this is your yeah, building? Yeah, my ah, building. Okay. Hello, hello. <laughs> me, me, die, I'm die, die. This is the thing. Yeah. When you want to say something, somebody, oh, you're Mickey, you're Mickey. Yeah. <laughs> this is why I, Mark, Mark. I watch every year. Of your video. Thank you very and much. I, I, I got a, a ring ringing on your YouTube. You are the best because this bell is it's very important. Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Okay. See you soon. Cheese. Cheese. Must say not cheese, cheese yeah. American. You don't yeah. say uh, sipsy. 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 <laughs> sipsy. sipsy. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you very much. much. Thank, you, so Thank much. you. Okay, I lost I lost what I wanted to say. Ah. Uh, Important fact about this market, SVU Money Market is open only every Tuesday and Thursday. If you come here on any other day, you won't find here anything at all, because it's, it's, it's university, people are busy here, people are studying here. So every Tuesday and every Thursday from 7 a.m. till probably 2 p.m. And the market itself is consists of three parts. Here is the main corridor. Here we can find many masks, toys, accessories, shoes, clothes and so on. At the end, near the stadium, there are a few stalls with uh, coffee, with some street food. And also, there are two wings. Behind this building, we can find some street food and many fresh vegetables and even meat. And another wing behind me, behind this building, here we can find lots of ready-to-eat meals and street food. Beetroot, me make up quad leg beetroot. Oh, carrot, carrot, they make up. Is a cabbage, they make up. 
วันนี้มีคนเยอะใช่ไหมครับ Many people lunchtime I was walking around for too long It's lunchtime and lunchtime is the peak time of any market We are surrounded with office buildings This is a city center which is why all office workers are coming here for their lunch สวัสดีครับอันนี้ขนมคืออะไรครับทองม้วนสดค่ะทองม้วนทองม้วนทอดทองม้วนทอดอักล้องหนึ่งเท่าไหร่สาบาทใช่ไหมครับโอเคเอาหนึ่งทองครับได้ค่ะค่ะค่ะอยมาวันไหนอีกร้อยครับสักครู่อร่อยมากจริงเหรอจริงโอเคโอเคไฟลงคิงไฟลงคิงครับลิมเลวเชียร์อะไรอันนี้เชียร์อะไรครับคืออะไรครับอันนี้ขนมขนมไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่ถุงทองม้วนทองม้วนสดใช่ไหมคะทองม้วนทอดสดทอดสดสดทองม้วนสดทองม้วนสดโอเคขอบคุณมากครับทองม้วนสดทองม้วนสดมีมะพร้าวใช่ไหมครับทองม้วนสด soft pancakes with coconuts Much easier. Soft pancakes with coconuts. Hamuan salt. Probably green color comes from pandan leaves, and this white thing is a coconut. Coconut flesh. Coconut meat. Hamuan salt. I forgot how to say. But these pancakes are really amazing. It was really good, guys, and I've noticed one more interesting thing about this market. Now it is past afternoon time, and since we're surrounded by tall buildings, the sun is hidden behind them, which is why the market now in this is in the shadow. For this reason, walking around has become much more comfortable because you don't feel this heat from the sun, from the sunlight. So you don't need to worry about getting uh, suntan or sunstroke or heat stroke or whatever. So the atmosphere is even more comfortable. However, there are many more people. So if you're afraid of sun, but don't afraid of the crowd, you can come here after 12 p.m. and still enjoy amazing variety of foods. This is 45 baht, 16 pieces, 130 baht. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, she, 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 baht, right? Must wait five minutes. 45 baht, 
four or five pieces. Let's try. What is so special about it? Maybe this is the sauce made of tears, tears of unicorn. And this stuff, which is seaweed, looks very delicious though. Very, very tender meat. Probably these are the best, the most exclusive Japanese pigs because this is like a Japanese food stall. Yeah. These are the legendary pigs from Tokyo. They had amazing life. They lived in, in a nice condo. And finally, it was the peak of their life. They had become Kyoza. What is it? What is it? Pan crepes. Pan crepes. Pan crepes. Pan crepes. Some biscuits, like cookie. Kha lai khap. Oi, yai mak. Yai mak. One pet. My pet. My pet, na. My pet, the aloy. It's 1 p.m. and some people sold everything they've got. Some people start baking, but quite many vendors are still here. What do you got? Guys, this dish I highly recommend you. Yam kai sep. Ao yam kai to, de mi khap? De mi mi ao khao khap. Mi ao khao cha khap. ธรรมดาห้าสิบอ่าฮะโอเคโอเคเอาเอาธรรมดาครับธรรมดาธรรมดาใช่ครับเป็ดปกติครับปกติครับใช่ครับใส่ใส่จานใส่จานครับอยาก
าสี่สิบกี่ชิ้นกี่อันห้าลูกห้าลูกห้าลูกไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่อันลูก There are many classifiers for everything in Thailand for cars for people for uh, seeds for chili for sausages I told you about it before maybe a few months ago so universal classifier is an it's like uh, five things you can say an about everything however about these sausages uh, the classifier is called look so when you want to order something uh, like these sausages you gotta say au ha look tell me cup look Palamai mengan luk, cem ya kap? Ya, and and the same uh, used for fruits. Fruits is palamai. Uh, you gotta say if you wanna buy two apples, you you, you can point your finger and say our song luk. It means two things, two items. Okay, our ha luk kap, sisi ba, cem ya? Okay. Not the healthiest food, but it is very tasty. Kau pun kap. And in case you don't know digits in Thai language, you can say "ao shoot ning." Shoot is mean pack. Ning uh, mean one, so you just say "shoot ning," pack like pack one, because in Thai language it's not one pack. You gotta say uh, pack one, people two, apple three, not three apples. You gotta say first thing and then digits how many things you want. This is a thing about Thai language. Run, run. ไม่ร้อนไม่อร่อยไม่ร้อนไม่ร้อยกินได้ very hot very tasty very creamy a little bit sour mm. yeah this is the street food you were looking for 40 baht for this bag Some dishes with salmon. The salmon, right? Mm. Mm. Right in the yeah, saba, right yes. salmon. How much? Oh, this one and thirty nine baht. Right, thirty nine. Ah, this. Sixty nine baht. Oh, nice. Looks very good. One hundred thirty nine baht. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This salmon has traveled so far from Norway to Thailand, but Thai people really love eating salmon. However, it is pretty expensive here, for obvious reasons. But if you feel a bit bored of Thai food, it's good that you can try it here. However, here it costs 139 baht, but in a restaurant it would cost 250, 350 baht, which is two, two and a half uh, times more. All right. Many people are about to close, but f uh, fruits and vegetable section is still here. Hello. Do you need some tea? Oh, thirty baht, right? One shot. Copper, right? Want 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 อันนี้น้ำชิมเชื่ออะไรครับน้ำชิมน้ำชิมน้ำปลาหวานน้ำน้ำชิมน้ำปลาหวานน้ำปลาหวานอ่าอ่าที่นั่นเหรอแน่แน่นากิ้งนากิ้งนากิ้งเพชรไหมไม่เพชรไม่เพชรเหรอไม่เพชรกินดูค่ะกินดูชิมชิม it means you can you can try for free ชิมชิมโอ้เวนจ่าสวยนะ When the when the soy, this thing. If you come to Thailand, this is something you really should try. Not just some uh, noodles or pad Thai. This is the uh, food of streets. Mm. Aloy, aloy, na? Because this is uh, mango, sweet and sour mango. It is not fully ripe. Sometimes it's even much, uh, much crispier, much, much more sour, because the sauce. You see this sauce inside. It's it's sweet, sticky sauce with shrimps. And even though, and even though, in your head, in my head, mixing shrimps, sweet sauce, and 
sweet mango. Sounds like a really bad idea. I tried it first 10 years ago when I came to Thailand the very first time uh, in 2012. And since then, I just cannot, cannot stop eating this thing. You can buy it in Big C, you can buy it in Tesco Lotus, but here the, the portion is much bigger and it is cheaper. Sweet and sour mango, yellow mango with this Namjim Nam Pao Wan. Namjim Nam Pao Wan. Very tasty thing. These tiny, tiny dried shrimps with mango. Really, you should try it. This is a real uh, $1 street food because this pack, this pack costs only 30 baht, but it is really, really tasty. Once you try it, once you realize how amazing the taste is, you just cannot stop. Kapi Wan. This is different. Spicy. Spicy. Uh -huh. If you come to a market and somebody say chim, it means you can try it for free and you don't have to buy. However, they are so sweet, it's just impossible to walk away and, and not to buy. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Pumpkin pet die. A little bit more salty. Cam noi. Cam a cup. Cam noi. Mmm. Alloy do I? Alloy do I? They have some chop tea soup. Mmm. Try. Hi. Our our falang do I? Our our kilo kilo one cup. Falang yakin falang. อ่าอันนี้หรือก็เบียร์ครับเอาเอาเอานิ่มหน่อยใช่ครับหน่อยหน่อยหน่อยหน่อยหน่อยหน่อยหน่อยหน่อยหน่อยหน่อยหน่อ
much better in the evening time. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you have enjoyed this tour. I hope it was fun. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Write a comment. Always feel free to communicate in, in the comments because writing comments, it's uh, some kind of craft, some kind of art, because sometimes your comments are more interesting than my entire video. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Ah, okay, Mickey, go back to sleep. By the way, there is a parking lot. Probably not that cheap because this is a city center, but if you're coming by car or by bike, if you, if you are willing to stuck in the traffic jam on this street, then yeah, you can park here. All right, Mickey, too much talking.